Brightstorm has thousands of high-quality videos covering all major subjects. Please check out more at www.brightstorm.com. There are two special right triangles, 45-45-90 and 30-60-90 triangles. Now what's special about this 30-60-90 triangle is that of the three sides that are all going to be different, I only need to know one and I could find the other two. So that's pretty amazing that of the three sides of a triangle, when it's a 30 degree, a 60 degree, and a 90 degree, I only need to know one side and I can find the other ones. So the shortcut, and again, this is based on the Pythagorean theorem, is to find your longer leg. Now how do I know that this is my longer leg? Well, if I look at my angle measures, 30 degrees is my smallest measure, which means the side that is opposite of 30 will be my shortest leg. The next longest will be my next largest angle. And since 60 degrees is smaller than 90, 60 degrees is my next longest leg. And then, of course, our hypotenuse is always the longest side in our triangle. So to go from our shorter leg to our longer leg, I need to multiply by the square root of 3. So if this side is, let's say, 5 units, then your longer leg will be 5 times the square root of 3. Now let's say you want to find your hypotenuse. To go from your shorter leg to your hypotenuse, all you need to do is multiply by 2. So this is going to be 2 times s. So if s is 5, your hypotenuse will be 10. So this works in both directions. So let's say you had your longer leg and you wanted to find the other two sides. Well, first, and actually I guess I forgot to write down right here that you would multiply by the square root of 3. So let's say you wanted to go in the opposite direction, from your longer leg to your shorter leg. Well, the inverse operation of multiplying by 3 is to divide by the square root of 3. The inverse operation of going from your hypotenuse to your shorter leg is going to be not multiplying by 2, but dividing by 2. So the key leg in this triangle is this shorter leg, because from here you can find your hypotenuse by multiplying by 2, and you can find your longer leg. So use these shortcuts whenever you see a triangle with 30, 60, and 90 degrees. And by two, I can't do this with you two laughing back there. Work it, work it. So if we had, no, that's not right, three coplanar points. So have you ever gotten off an airplane? <laughs> that should be less than. Yeah. Dang. Is it like 500 degrees in here or what? All right, so when you're in chemistry class, you're gonna be doing a lot of work. You're gonna be bleh, starting over. So as an example, we could consider like you've got a chain hanging from two, um, two fix. 